Nearly a hundred species of birds nest in the oaks, including a Chinese species. The azure-winged magpie's main habitat is around Beijing, so it's always been something of a mystery to find it in this part of Spain. There is a theory that it was brought back from the east by early Spanish traders. A more plausible explanation is that the magpie's range once stretched all the way across Europe and Asia. Over thousands of years, it declined, leaving the two populations continents apart. The azure wings have to contend with a host of predators hunting among the Deesa oaks. The black-shouldered kite is another bird that occurs in China, but its main home is Africa. It preys on small birds, including young azure wings. Here, it's caught a corn bunting. Azure wings nest close to one another in the trees, almost in colonies, so there are always several parents on the alert. The black-shouldered kites are more concerned with courtship. The male lets his female take food from him. But it's not the kites that have caused the alarm. As a ladder snake climbs towards the azure wing nest, the whole colony unites to distract it. The young are crouched down in the nest and the snake seems to have missed them. The magpie's combined mobbing has driven the snake from this particular tree. Away from the trees, out in the open, it's the snakes that are vulnerable. The short-toed eagle catches many of its snakes between the trees on the deesa. It grips them close to the head, then attempts to immobilize them. The snake is not poisonous, but the eagle will take vipers, which are venomous. Surprisingly, the eagle is not immune to venom. It relies for protection on the thick scales on its legs and the dense layers of feathers on its body. The long legs also keep the snake's head well away from the more vulnerable parts. When the snake begins to coil around it, the eagle tries to maintain its hold on the snake's head. Catching a ladder snake is one thing, swallowing it is quite another. 